Friday, October 13th, looking at space weather, and it's all about the eclipse. And just an uh, illustration here. Now it goes right by the Yucatan. And it goes down Central America, South America, Brazil, and then it exits. This is the information in Mexico right here. So it'll be, it'll be in the Yucatan. Now there's uh, the Mayans belief follows stars and their interpretation of eclipses is were signs of destruction in the Drexen Kodak. I mean the writings that did survive that weren't burnt from Spain. They do have some information, a eclipse as a demon biting the sun. This is the way they looked at it. Now taking a look today, October 13th, Friday, the sun, this was on the 12th. You had uh, this, remember this little circle here is the size of the sun. So we had an uh, ejection, ball-like. Again, this in the northern part, hemisphere of the sun, big ball here. Take a look closely. That's what, uh, this is the size of the sun. This release was, um came from the northern part and it was bigger than the sun look at the latest oh another one okay this is the latest image from the sun now looking at noah there it is right there look how big that thing is this is the 12th right there okay we had a drop right here in the flares cmes dropped almost all the way down to a b and then it's picked picking up again i find that strange the way it just dropped what else has happened now look at the asteroids all of a sudden these were added the seventh the seventh the seventh the seventh the seventh okay so we had two three four four asteroids that went between the, the moon and the earth and these are added they like to add stuff after it passes okay on the 10th we had another one at 0 0.4 and on the 12th we had another one real close 0 0.2 and the 14th on saturday we have one scheduled for 0 0.4 let's take a look at this one okay this one's 23 td7 and that a co5 and a minimal distance 0 0.00107 which is 99 approximately 99,000 miles away that's pretty close let's see what else we could find on close approaches the latest let's see uh 13th and the 14th anytime you got point zero point zero zero that's close point zero zero twenty three tq3 got another one twenty three tc7 at zero point zero zero four so in other words let's check out the next day look at this one here october 20th 2020 you are point zero zero nine eleven so apparently we're in a swarm of of asteroids and they're reporting it the close bys after they pass the other words they read just the numbers after they safely pass by check out the comments see what else posted new here's a uh, 12 p utah the desert remote observatory let's see what they what they captured you still see the the gap right there but i was on the 10th go back check out michael he, michael always provide he got okay this is michael take a closer look remember it's in the constellation hercules so this is a i don't know what star that is i didn't check before but it, it is in the constellation hercules and that's what we have on comet 12p so this today is the day they call for jihad against us but i still say be careful this weekend okay that's all i have for now i am on watch watching this these events if anything major or foes no